So today what we're going to be doing is we're going to be trying out this build that I tweaked a little bit. Um, I already put out a build like this and it's an explosive damage build, but man, I was messing with a few pieces and I was like, man, you know what? Maybe we can make this just a little bit better. So we tweaked it out and I think you guys are really going to enjoy it. So let's, um, let's try to hit this control point real quick. I'm going to set up real quick. Ooh. Oh no, there we go, there we go, there we go. Let's see how well this thing does. Oh, look at those status effects. That's what I wanted to see. I really wanted to see that. Let's go pick up some, um, some of these trophies. Oh, it's already dead. It's already dead. This thing is just like blowing up everything. This is crazy. I want to pick up these. Who's next? We got somebody left? Oh, I This is crazy. This is so much damage. All right, wait for this to set up. Oh, what was that? Who's that? Drive by. Who said skill builds, explosive damage builds can't be fun to run around with? Oh. <laughs> Yo, he disappeared. No way. Oh my Jesus, I love this amount of armor though. Oh, and we're running about a little over 1 million armor. That's what I like about it. <laughs> this is crazy. Oh man, this is so much fun. Where, is there anybody else? Oh, wait. oh we got one over here. All right, perfect. So we're good here. Now we just have to get the... Detecting additional hostile contacts. Oh man, we're gonna get the additional hostile report. Plus the... Oh no! This is crazy. Let me back up, let me back up. Yo! How they get so many people? That's what I want to know. Where did all these people come from? Where did they? Where did these guys come from? Oh my Jesus! Oh, okay, this is, this is too much. This is too much. All right, we're gonna break down this build right after this because I think it. I think it's worthy of it. I think it was worthy of breaking down. Did you just see how I dodged that? <laughs> oh my. I think we have an elite convoy at the same... Oh, no, no, no. That was, that was what I was trying to do. Throwing these nades at me. Perfect. Just look at him go. Just look at him go. Is that one guy here? Oh no. Almost blew myself up. guy up top right oh 
that's who was throwing nades at me. Remember I couldn't figure it out? Oh, we finished the elite convoy. Wait, that's it? Oh, no, 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 no. We, they came up behind us. No, no, no. We got one more. We got one more. Crazy the amount of damage we're doing. Let's see if I hit him with that. Oh. oh no 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 no! What's this shot? Oh. Okay, here we go. Woo. We got this. We definitely got this. Wait, where is it? Then we just got one more. He should be almost dead, man. There's no way he's still alive up there. GG's. I think we got it right now. Ha! That was it, right? Yeah, there we go. Destroy these real quick. Oh, wait. You know we got... Oh, we got rogue agents! What the? I was not expecting that. I was not expecting that at all. Oh, I was not expecting that. Nice. There we go. They're both over there. What is he doing? Where is he going? Where's this dude going? I was trying to collect my loot. I was trying to collect my loot. Let's see if we can get this guy up here. I guess I can't get him, but I can hit this one over here. All right, so this should be able to hit them over there. There's no way. Is it too far? I guess so. Oh, my turret got him right there. Ooh, he chopped me up. Providence piece. Let me check out this loot in a second. Running from me. Oh, that's it. I think we finished it. I think we finished it. Oh, yes, we did. There we go. Let's destroy all this then. What else do we have in here? Um, I already have a pair of those. Oh, wow. This is actually almost perfectly rolled. Not bad at all. What's up here? Alright. Ooh, we got a lot of loot laying around, man. Um, none of that right there. At least I got that one piece I needed. I'm going to break down this build real quick, though, just to show you guys how much damage we're doing. So if we get into the build, guys, this is where the build is going to shine um, it's because we are running the demolitionist class specialization. Now you need to make sure you run that because that's the only way you can run the artillery turret. And if you look at our damage on this, look at this 3.6 million. And this gets all the way up to 4 million every time we pick up a trophy. Now, if you also look at the bleed damage, 86,000, and that's without any of the buffs and the bleed duration, 12 seconds. Now we head over here. Take a look at the striker drone. It's doing 74,000, and this gets up into the 80,000 range every time we pick up a trophy. So it's very, very powerful, but you got to make sure you run that demolitions class. Now, 
um, I run with the pistol because that allows me to unlock six skill tier and still have 1.1 million armor because we get the one skill tier from this name pistol. And then we have instinct on here. So we're getting 30% extra damage, skill damage, sorry, every time we're hitting with our pistol and then our skills doing damage. So skill damage and weapon damage, 30% for five seconds. And as long as I'm hitting those targets, it's going off. Now, I like it running 1.1 million arms because I can run around and pick up those trophies. That's what's crazy about it. So for the mask, we're running the China Light Mask skill tier. We have skill damage, skill haste, and skill haste on here. Now, if you feel like you don't need that type of skill haste on this build, you can put status effects, but you're going to get enough status effects from skill efficiency from the backpack when you have a full stack. Now, this is going to give us 15% explosive damage, which is amazing and what you should be running on any type of explosive damage build. Now we run with the Hannah Yu chest piece. Now this is going to have kinetic momentum and you remember this stacks increase your total skill damage by 1% and total skill repair by 2% up to 15 stacks per skill. Loss went on cooldown. Now we have skill tier here, skill haste, skill damage, and skill haste again. So definitely um something you're going to notice is we're running skill damage, skill haste, or skill damage and status effects. But with the hand of you, the one piece, we get that 10% skill haste. Now for the holster, we're running the wyvern holster. So this is going to give us skill damage and status effects because we're running a two-piece wyvern. And the reason why I'm about status effect is because that bleed damage we get from the artillery turret. You know, every time the artillery turret hits, that bleed ticks. So we have skill tier in here, and then we have skill damage. And I decided to roll status effects on this one, 10%. We get into the knee pads. These are the golden knee pads. This gives me 10% status effects. The one piece improves on that bleed damage plus what our backpack is giving us. Um, so we have 170,000 armor right here with status effects and skill damage. So the two pieces that have status effect and skill damage, knee pads and holster. We head over to the gloves and the gloves have 10% skill damage, 10% status effects, and then look one skill tier, 10% skill damage and status effects again. So another status effect skill damage piece. And then the backpack, right? The backpack is what makes this build, allows you to run 1.1 million armor. You get a weapon damage, you get armor, you get skill tier. So we'll be at six skill tier every time we have the pistol out. And then if you also notice attributes, we roll skill haste. Now, I don't run um, any type of skill duration on there. There's no point because our skills are gonna be up long enough for us to keep them. So skill haste is what you want. Now, remember, kill confirmed, we're going to have 30%, right? So we're going to have 30% um, skill efficiency, 30% skill damage, and 3% um, armor regeneration. Now, every time we pick up a skill thing, we're also going to have 25% skill efficiency. Um, we're going to have 20% bonus armor and then 5% weapon damage. That's why running this build is perfect for any type of explosive damage build and before we were running this perfect combined arms shooting an enemy increases total skill damage by 30 percent but with this giving us 30 percent skill efficiency that's giving us skill damage status effects it's just so much benefit for running the backpack but you do have to build that stack that's the one thing but you should be able to build it and hold it once you have it at 30 percent and then bonus is when you get that 10% stack of skill efficiency because that just makes you hit harder. And like I said, if you notice with the full stack, we were at 3.6 million. Look right now, 3 million. So you gain 600,000 extra damage. Bleed without anything is still 68,000. So you're still hitting pretty hard. But once you have that full stack, that's where this build 100% shines. Same thing with the uh, assault turret. You see 62,000. Now, if we look at the, um, the mods, remember you get that 10% damage mod from our uh, when you run the demolitionist class so you can put that on right here you're gonna get one extra mortar round you want to put that on and then just run skill haste that's what i would recommend for that and then for your and then for your um striker drone we have duration oh sorry that's just a skin we have um health and then we have damage so that is what i would run for these three and that, that's how i would have that set up just like that but this is the build right here that you guys saw is clear. It's one of my favorite builds to run now. And I finally went away from um, perfect combined arms. And I went with a backpack and being able to run more armor. I've noticed I still perform really well. So this is the build right here. I'm a big fan of this backpack. A lot of people, um, some people hate it. Some people love it. But for me, 
the exotic backpack is definitely my go-to backpack. And then I just run this pistol right here. So yeah, that's it. That is the build right there. You guys already see how much damage you guys can do. And then remember, when you do, as long as you have the pistol out, you'll have six skill tier because of that. But right there, this is my go-to. If you guys have any questions, let me know, man. This is um, this is the place to put it. Just use the comment section down below. And we're going to wrap up this video here. Thank you guys again. And I will see you guys in the next one. Until then, nothing but skill is out.